Don't screw this up, Harvey. I don't know if that was the right thing to do. Why did I do that? I just can't... I just can't second-guess myself. Dangerous place to stand. Be so easy to slip and fall. Batman? Oh, you scared the hell out of me. Well, it's good to see you. <laughs> I was just telling someone how much I'd love to get you on my payroll. You've gone too far. Leave Wayne alone. Wayne? What, is this about the whole seizing his assets thing? You're not gonna break my legs, are you? <laughs> or maybe you're just gonna make threats. If it comes to that. <laughs> Little brutish, don't you think? I'll admit, I'm surprised to see you helping Wayne. Seems kinda small potatoes for you. Maybe you haven't seen the news, but he hasn't been the most upright citizen lately. Why should I do anything to help him? You're losing your mind, and everyone can see it, Dent. You want to save me? I protect everyone. So it seems. I guess I do owe you one. Now Wayne is just another curveball this stupid city threw my way. Hill and his goons, the Waynes, the children of Arkham. I'm finally starting to understand, to see just how sick Gotham really is. To save Gotham, I need to do some bad before it gets better. Ready to go. Do it. What did you do? Our Lady Arkham's drugs destroyed. Man, we lost a bunch of our own guys! The apartment next door! Jesus Christ! Oh, man. That blast was way bigger than you said! We must have taken out a whole city block with it! We stopped the children of Arkham. That's all that matters. That's what a leader does. I feel like I should thank you. Seeing as you did give Gordon that tip, I don't care what your end goal was. Even one innocent life is too high a cost. Then you're thinking too small. I doubt the police would see it that way. There has been some conflict with the police, that's true. Like Gordon. Oh, he really wasn't happy when I went over his head to get the location of the drug stockpile. But I had him taken care of. <laughs> what did you say about Gordon? Now, hang on, Batman, hang on! I had to make an example of him. To get people to respect... Gordon is on Gotham's side, Harvey. He's fighting for this city, too. Batman, I'm sorry. It's like I told you. I... Crime Alley. They took him to Crime Alley! <laughs> Let's take a ride, gentlemen. What the hell is this? Here, Dent says you're getting in the way of protecting the city. Dent's got you brainwashed. No! He's trying to help! The children of Arkham are out of control, and no one, no one is do- Batman! What a mess. Thank you, Batman. Save the thanks, and explain to me why I just watched half a city block go up in flames. Dent took out the warehouse with the drugs, the location that I gave to you. Are you accusing me of something, Batman? Just say it. Come on! Let's hear it! I only told you. Dent knows, so someone you talked to told him. You know we're on the same team here. 
So stop leaning on me and let's figure out what happened. Tell me what you know. By the time I got back to the precinct, Dent already had the information. He strong-armed it out of Commissioner Grogan. I didn't even have time to scratch my ass before I got hauled out here. Dent's position makes him dangerous. He's persuasive and he has power. Dent thinks that what he's doing is best for Gotham. Execution. Martial law. I know. There's no saving him this time, Batman. And there's no world in which he manages to set this right. There's no hope for a rabid dog. We need to lock him up and throw away the key. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is what it's come to. We have a lot of work to do. Everything is such a goddamn mess. But we gotta start somewhere. You know your officers, Jim. Take the people you trust and start hobbling Dent's army. Get your precinct back. You make it sound easy. No, it won't be. But if anyone can do it, it's you. You're trusted. <sighs> yeah. Gotta handle this first, though. We will get through this, Jim. I'm glad we're on the same side. He's causing the feedback loop. He somehow connected a, a black box computer to your encrypted network. God, it's like a digital battering ram. If he keeps this up, he could smash through the Batcave firewalls at any minute. He'd have access to the Bat computer. <sighs> Hang on, Lucius. It's Alfred. I'm patching him in. Al, Lucius figured out how Penguin's cracking my security. He has a device that. I'm afraid we have another problem to deal with. Mr. Dent is pulling up to the manor as we speak, and he's not alone. Already? Sir, are you all right? Penguin's hacking assaults are getting worse. At this rate, he'll have my tech compromised by the end of the night. Only place he could be hacking me from is Wayne Enterprises. Well, I don't envy your position. Even Batman can't be in two places at once. I need to stop Penguin. You go to the Batcave and make sure Harvey doesn't find it. I understand. Time to go to work. Time. Are you there? I'm off site, but I've tapped into the security systems to give us an advantage. I can let you know where all's old guards are, and which routes are clear. So long as you can confirm Penguin's black box when we're in the lab. I can do that too. Avoid that hallway. More guards ahead. Go right. Wait. Drones ahead. <laughs> Turn around. Head for the up. I'm opening the doors. Now! <clears throat> Oswald is in my office. Naturally. Get 
Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Does anyone have him? Useless youth! You're all bloody useless! Hey, it's the bad. You're a dead man! Well, if it ain't the biggest bleeding pleasure to see your sour mug again. Glow while you can, Cobblepot. I'm taking you down. Mm, yeah? I don't think so. In fact, I think it's you who's going to get beat by me. I'm pretty good in a fight, you know. Been in a few scuffles here and there. That's not a smart bet. Well, I've got a bit of inside information that gives me the advantage. You know, I like your style, Batman. I really do. But you're really starting to be a pain in the ass. The children of Arkham are going to walk all over this city, and there isn't anyone who can stop us! Not even you! But this company, under my expert stewardship, with the technology being developed, we could control nations. What are you and Lady Arkham planning? Oh, I'm glad you asked. You know, Wayne was thinking too small. He was only tinkering around. So focused on consumer technology. Oh, I see. It helps you plan things out ahead of time. Neat trick, though. Pretty flashy for someone who only wears black. How? Not just for fashion. It's very functional. Face it, Batman. You're outmatched. Without your tech, you're just a man in a pointy-ear costume. You can't stop us! Watch me. Come on, Batman! Show me what you got. Butte is almost done hacking your precious network. That's the device. Few more minutes, or your secrets are mine. I will stop you before that happens. Oh, is this how it feels when you put on that suit? I like it! you learned yet? I've shut you down! I'm the one with the toys now, Batman. <laughs> this is the start of a new legacy! And I'm afraid you don't have any place in it.
dead. It's done, Cobblepot. Your revolution is over. It started with you, and it ends with Lady Arkham. Ugh. Oh, good luck. You'll never find her in time. Where is she? What is she planning? Uh, the message is the same as it's ever been. We will open your eyes. The city's hypocrisy will be exposed. Tell me where to find her. Piss off! I'm not telling you anything. You're nothing but a pawn to her. And you're a fool if you think otherwise. You don't get it, do you? I'm not a pawn. I'm a soldier. I die before I sell out the cause. But you can help yourself by talking. I'll stop her either way. What the? Just cut me down, mate. I mean, what will people say? <laughs> Just tell them, Wayne, put up a fight. 